Alrighty guys, welcome back and in this video I'm going to show you a really cool way to get the most frequently occurring item in a list. But before we do, I just want to give a quick shout out to Caleb Haslam and Nathan Bradley. They each contributed five bucks to my Patreon account. I love you guys. I want to have your babies and yeah, let's get on with the tutorial. Alright, so let's say that we have any list, but in this tutorial, let me go ahead and copy this. Uh, all right, so there we go. So I just have this chunk of text right here, and I don't even remember. Huh, I don't even remember where I pasted this from somewhere, maybe on my website or something. But we have any text, you can have any list, and we want to get the words that occur most frequently. Maybe my PR guy was yelling at me, he's like, dude, you say the same words over and over again, and I probably do. So, how can we do that? Well, we can write our own custom function or I'll show you guys a cool little module. So from collections, we're going to import the class counter. So this is going to, this is actually a pretty cool class if you want to dive deeper. But what it essentially does is you pass it in a list and then you can run a bunch of cool statistics on it. Now we already have one issue and that's that this right here is just a big old long string. We actually need to convert all of these words into a list. So in order to do that, it's actually really easy. Just say uh, words, you can name your variable, anything you want, of course, for this text string. In order to make it individual, uh, a list of words, all you do is you write split. So that breaks up a string into a list. So now we have a list that's, I don't know, like maybe 50 words long or whatever and just to show you guys real quick just print this out all right so now we can see that we have a list look at that looking good so now that we have a list we want to get the most frequently occurring word so how do we do that well let me just make a i'll just name it counter why not and i'm going to set this equal to counter which is an object from the counter class or an instance is the proper term so whenever we initialize this, what we do is we pass in a list. So what that's gonna do is it's gonna say, this is our object, run a bunch of statistics about this list, which is essentially this right here. So boom roasted, it did that. Now once it's initialized, we can just you know print out whatever we want. So let's say that we want the top three occurring words. Well, for counter, which was our object, there is a function called most common. Now inside here, we can just write any number we want, uh, three, five, whatever. I'm gonna say three, and that's gonna give me the three most common words in that list. So now I'll just print top three, and there we go. So this is actually pretty cool. It returns a list of tuples, and the tuple has two parts to it. The first one is, of course, the word itself, the item in the list, and the second one is the frequency counter. So this says, hey, these are your three most common occurring words. The, you wrote five times. Two, you wrote four, and in was in your list three times. So a lot of awesome information. So there you go. Again, a real quick tutorial, but definitely useful. And again, there's a lot more to this counter class, but now that I you know, got your guys' uh, feet a little bit wet, you can dive in a little more if you want. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.